All right, gentlemen, end of the lesson. Lesson three. We fought through it. Uh, definitely learned some stuff today. Uh, hate that JP couldn't be here again, but that's all right. The, the people who came, they, they got some good knowledge. So what we'll do uh, is go around the line and everybody speak on what they learned and, uh, and, and just go from there. So let's start with Mac. Uh, I mean, you talked about how you wanted me to not stand up so much. You wanted me to, you know, bend my knees a little bit more, bend over the ball a little bit more, which helped, you know, get better contact. It wasn't bending or topping the ball anymore. And and for practice recommendations and going forward, that's something in the pre-swing. So that's mm -hmm. something that you could work on any time of the day. You, you don't have to be on the golf course since it deals with posture. Yes, sir. So go on the hoagie. So maybe we just kind of, we worked on the basic fundamentals of a golf swing. Um, he told me when I practice on the range, I should do a game or drill called Be Honest With Yourself. And in that, I need to hit 10 balls with each club and just honestly evaluate where they went, how far they went, what ball flight they had, if they hook, slice, fade, draw, or straight. Yeah, e each shot for you in that drill, you need to have a game plan for each shot on where it's going and how it's going to get there. And that allows for you on each shot to focus in. In the beginning, you were kind of a little vague in exactly what you wanted to work on, which means it's a lot of things going on. So in order to narrow down the dispersion rate, just focus on each shot. And that, to be honest, drill does that for you. So moving on to Josh. Yeah, just keep working on uh, that drill with the, the alignment stick to try to work on not hooking it so much. So do that and just try to match it up on the back screen, like you said. All right, and for you, uh, your fix dealt with actually in the swing, and it, it's tough. It's tough because it's something you have to stay diligent with and practice on. So if you can continue to pull out that alignment stick two to three times a week and just focus on getting that first position and then taking it to the top, you'll get way, way better. So, but with that, gentlemen, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, thank you. All right, and then the last lesson is going to be over at the preserve. Okay, it's going to be an on-course lesson. All the things we've learned so far. So look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you. Thank you.